original schedule, okay, today we will stop this topic called information literacy. Okay? So basically I won't follow the schedule in a you already know this, right? I don't follow the schedule in the PowerPoint. Okay? I will first disclose to you something interesting first. Okay? So basically what is the information literacy? Information literacy is uh, I will say I will think it that way, is the skills for you to um, explore the data in the internet. Okay, there is a group already talking about one, one thing called deep web. Okay, uh, I will use some tools for you to uh, to understand. Okay, how deep the internet is. Okay, now I, I said that I don't follow it, so I will close it. Oh, I shouldn't close it. I have to inform you one thing first. Okay, so basically, what I was going to tell you is. Uh, is following some part of it here, okay, it's talking about Google, okay, okay about how to use Google. So first of all, uh, I want to do a survey first, okay? Yeah, let me close this guy first. Uh, home. Okay, my survey is how many people is not using Google? How many of you using Bing? Ah, good, no one. Very nice, very nice. How many of you using Yahoo? Okay, also no. So all people using Google. Very smart. Smart choice, huh? I use Google since the year 2000. Okay. Now, Google, okay, now first I will tell you, okay, this part is to teach you the skills. Okay, so what are the skills that involve? Basically, what is Google? Google is to tell, is a search engine, okay? And the search engine gives you the current I mean, uh, the most of the data. Now, in this part of my lecture, I will tell you something. First, you cannot search data that, let's say, 10 years ago, okay, in Google, right? Say, I want to have a, a picture of myself, okay, or the picture of other course teachers, okay? That is 10 years ago, okay? How can you use Google to search it? Can you? No, basically no. Okay, so Google only can give you something uh, for reasons, okay, like news, okay, like uh, my personal homepage, I keep on updating my page content, but you cannot take back in the history. So in this part of the lecture, I just, I mean, uh, tell you all the things that I know, basically how to take back, date back to some time, okay, and later in this lecture, I will show you the web page of CUHK back in 1997 which is possible, okay? So, Google. Now, tell you one truth about Google first, okay? I know, in your, in your, uh, I mean, uh, during the start of the discussion of the project topic, okay, you will usually do one search. Right? How many of you didn't do so? <laughs> yeah, if you didn't do so, I, I just uh, give my respect to you, okay? Yeah, usually we will search something like this, right? Oh, I, don't, I cannot think of any topic, so I will search for oh, ENGG 1000, CHK, or maybe top, top for me more, something more, project, or title, okay? So you cannot search for anything. Now, first I tell you one thing about Google, okay? Google loves to cheat you guys, okay? It's always lying, okay? So what is the point that it's always lying? Look at here. How many search results tell you? 188, right? 188. Okay. So let me zoom in a bit. Okay. Zoom in. How to zoom in? Okay. How to zoom in? Okay. I cannot zoom in. Oh, okay. Zoom in a bit. So as you can see, it's very clearly 188. Now, what I'm going to do? Now, how many? Results, I mean, I mean, whether you know it or not, there is 10 results, right? 10 results in this page. So if it's 10 results, how many pages report to you? Four page, four times 10 is how many? 40. 40. Then what's the meaning of this number? What is the meaning of this number? It is a piece of lies, okay? Force results, okay? Just to give you a sense that oh, how many, how many results? And then you scroll down a bit, okay? 
then you find that you are being cheated. Okay. Now let's let's imagine that okay, maybe there is a bug. There is a bug in Google. Okay. There's more than four page. So why not we try it out? Next. Okay. It say that page two of about one hundred and eighty-eight results still goes on. One page less. Okay. Originally it said four. Now we have three. <laughs> One more. <laughs> and suddenly you got 24. And then no more. <laughs> now let's count how many how many results from this page. One, two, three, four, no more. So that means when you reach the end of the search result, this four page and two, two more previous page, so 20 plus four, 24, okay? When you reach the end of the search result, if you tell you the truth, okay? If you didn't dig down to the, to the bottom of the, of the search result, you don't know how many things that you will receive, okay? So that means what? That means if you type CHK, <coughs> this bunch of results are all lies. Don't believe it. Don't tell people that, oh, Google tell me that uh, CHK is very popular because CHK, when you search on Google, there is a one million result. This is a piece of lie. Don't believe in it. Okay? It is just a rough estimation. How rough it is? You already know how rough it is. It's not, I, I don't mean it's rough, it's a random number. Okay, basically, it's a random number. Oh, yeah. But I mean, uh, uh, I don't believe in it, basically. Okay? Give you one more whole, horrible result. Okay, the horrible result is if you just type in few words, okay, say, oh, I made one G. Okay, CUHK, okay. So this time it's report to you more, right? Well, usually it's like this if you have more keywords, that means that you want to have a more complex uh, results, okay? So the number of returns should be fewer. Okay, here is also a proof to you that it's a few results. Now, what's next? It said that it says nine pages. Ah, seems to fit uh, 1,000 something, because beyond the page nine, it should be pop up something more. Now, I click on page nine. <laughs> still believe in it? Yeah, still believe in it. Okay, yeah, interesting, huh? Don't believe in Google. Okay, give you one more thing. Very interesting, very interesting. I love that. Okay, the interesting part is, now this is um, my, my search engine setting. My search engine setting is point to .com.hk, right? So how about yours? Are you on the .com.hk? If you go to Google, I mean, uh, go to Google means that I type google.com. Okay, I type google.com, enter. It will automatically point to .hk. Okay, how about yours? Is it point to .com automatically? Okay, then good. Then you can do the same thing as SI together. I will type MAC. Okay, what is your results? Is it the same as I? No, right, because I I do some, uh, I mean, uh, people ask me about uh, Mac, Mac OS things, okay, so I search this too. Maybe we ignore this too, okay, on my screen. What is your ranking of Mac rumors? Where is your ranking? Does it even appear in your screen? No, no, right? Can you find Mac Air in your search results? Yes, is it the second one? No, no. That means what? That means Google is actually doing another thing. Customizing the search results. Yeah. Different people will receive different results. See? Uh, explore this, the first two, because the first two is from my search history. Okay, it's from my history of searching. Okay, and these are the suggestions. Okay? Map rumors, you don't have, right? Map book air, I'm the second one. Second search results. It's not your second search result. By the way, what is the first result? If you type MAT, what is the first result? 
What is that? Red, red what? Messi. Oh, Messi. Okay, maybe you have search for some food related things. How about you? No, no, no. it's not. Not. Oh, I, I, I haven't searched it. You haven't searched it. Oh, that that is cool. Okay, it's a a a kind of a injecting advertisement to you. Ah, oh, okay. How about you? Jam. <laughs> Great. Are oh, you also Messi? How about you? Was Messi? Oh, you a MacBook Air? Okay. Now, this is not something horrible. I mean, uh, injecting advertisement, we all know that because Google is an advertisement company. Do you know that? It's an IT and advertisement company. Now, do another thing. Wow, how about this? Uh, let me zoom out a bit. Okay, so in the bottom right corner, can you see that there's a link called usegoogle.com? Yeah. Yeah, click on that. Click on that. Okay, then it points to another site. Okay, it's pointing to another site. It's no longer point to .com.hk, right? How many of you after click in it? It's not pointing to .com. It's all pointing to .com, right? Okay. So what I'm going to do? Uh, same thing. M A C. Okay. Now don't care about about the interface. Don't care about the interface. I care about the suggestion. Okay, and look at the suggestion here. This time, I, I have the same result as this girl, Messi. I'm Messi this time. How about you? If you go to .com, if you go to click use Google.com, is it still Google? Uh, is it still giving you a web air? No, Mac, just Mac. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, then, oh no, you are still, oh no, it's uh, okay. Maxi, just like the same as I. Okay? So basically what it's going to talk about is second thing. Google is injecting advertisement based on the location. What is Maxi? Okay? Maxi is something uh, related to uh, I mean uh, online buying or shopping, okay? Basically there's a I mean uh, Many shops in the world. Okay, now I I'm a I'm a I, IT teacher, right? You know, already know that how 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 deep I'm in IT. So, dot com dot hk has recorded many information about me, and know that I'm using MacBook Air. I buy many Mac products. So the suggestion is always focus on IT products. Okay, and how about you? You are a different profile in Google. You have a different profile in Google, Google actually doing the profile over you. Okay? Now, if you think that it's too horrible, okay, you say, well, how, how is this possible, right? Too horrible. You can stop. You can ask Google, stop. Don't look up my history. Okay? How? Okay? Here. Click on this high pipe of results. Okay? Can you see this? This is on your page, Google search results page, the right, right hand side. Then it will don't follow your profile on Google. Okay? But well, remember, different locations have different profile. Okay? And here it means that you don't follow the profile and give you the results purely from, from what is supposed to be uh, stored in the search engine. So I have to go back uh, to google.com.hk first. Okay? Go back to .com.hk and do the Mac search again. So for me, the first Mac is uh, Apple. Now if I tell it that, yeah, hide my perfect results, they immediately change. Okay, but still a bias, bias a bit, okay? Basically, uh, the first thing is uh, an advertisement, and the second, second, I believe it's also an advertisement, it's also an advertisement, okay? Yeah. So this is uh, one dark, no, I mean, uh, not dark secret, okay? I mean, every people already know about it, okay? So if you are doing the search, okay, you want to avoid this kind of thing, okay? Click on that. Plus one more, if you don't want Google to use your own profile, if you don't want it, okay? It's very simple. Use this option, okay? 
This option means that basically it won't, it don't know who you are. It don't know who you are. Okay, I use this option. I do the Google, google.com. Okay, now I type map again. Hey, still, still bad book here. Oh, very horrible. Okay, so uh, I, I mean, uh, this is a lie, okay? I mean, I'm being cheap also. Well, how come album is still, still looking up, okay? Yeah, believe, I believe here, okay? Google may be doing something wrong. One more, one more thing about Google, okay? Then I will tell you how to use Google. If you really hate Google doing so, how do you jump, okay? I mean, uh, opt out from this uh, campaign. Okay, there is a thing called Google history. I don't know whether you know it or not. Very horrible. Yeah, you can do it together with me and understand how horrible Google is. Click on that. If you have typed Google history and the first search result, is it the same as I? I believe it should be the same. Click on that. Okay, ask for my input. Wow, eh? Yeah, you wow, that means that you already know what it is. It's no, what are my search activity? What are my recent search? Wow. Yeah, it's horrible, huh? Basically, it's look into what you have searched and suggest you things that are customized and they believe that it's suitable to you, okay? So, this is Google. Ah, horrible, huh? don't, don't, I mean, uh, you can believe it, but you are, you have to in your mind know that the search result may not be something that you want. Okay, there is some injection there. You have Google inject some advertisement, and uh, maybe something not related. Uh, I mean, uh, advertisement is not a big deal. Okay, it's trying to suggest you something related to you. Okay, if you don't want Google to do this thing, how to do it? Select all and remove that. <laughs> Try to minimize the things that have been polluted. Then you can clean up your search history. Okay? Now, I didn't talk about how to, uh, how to use Google, okay? Next time we'll talk about how to use Google. First of 